like growing personally and with like the the quality of content you put out not because you upgrade your technology but because you upgrade like your creativity i guess you could say like you're just yeah. better more productive at creating content um because let me tell you i feel the first video i put up i posted i filmed it four times before like the fifth time i actually like oh okay i'm gonna put this one up yeah and looking and i thought that was like the best video i could ever put up because i worked so hard on it like i had this backdrop that's pretty pretty shitty but it, i had this <laughs> backdrop and i i had these soft boxes or whatever that i didn't even know how to like correctly light anything i was totally like washed out whatever and then like looking back now it's like cringy looking at it i'm like ugh. Mm -hmm. but you know it's like you're gonna end up progressing and being better and you just need to start like everyone has like not the best first video but you mm -hmm. look at their latest video and it's like oh my gosh like they've grown so much as a person they grow so much as a youtuber so it's just start so i'd say one thing too just like to clarify everything is when you release like any type of work or when you're working on something should you just say to most people just release it and see what happens like you need to learn you need to like because like when we talk about this all the time it's like creativity is subjective you know mm -hmm. what i mean and like you said it doesn't matter what camera gear you use or anything but do you think it is a necessity to maybe just try your best but release it because you need to see how it starts picking up and all that like regardless of like what equipment you're using yeah well i also feel like part of part of what you're what you're, what you're trying to ask mm -hmm. is uh do you like let your <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, y'all. The ghost in the house right now. <laughs> the wind is roaring outside. And I forgot to close that window. Uh, I feel like part of the question that you were trying to ask is like, do you, a lot of people stop themselves because they critique themselves too much? Also, like mm -hmm. they they kind of overthink the edit, and then they should just put it out. Like yeah. you know what I mean? Like don't try to make it perfect every single time. Like just do the best you can, but don't spend too much time on it, and then just drop it. Yeah. So that's kind of what I've been. Um kind of like struggling even now with because i obviously want each video that i post to be better than the last one mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. but honestly like and i'm learning i'm learning this from people who actually like have like super successful youtube channels like i don't know if you watch gabriel conti mm. he's a really good creator like he makes amazing like videos he's such a good editor whatever anyways um like he even said like if you want to be consistent like you can't just expect every video to be better than your last one like yeah. you kind of just have to put one up you know what i mean um obviously don't just like bs it and like put out yeah, like report yeah, like yeah. hi i'm jessica cool Still bye. Your like, best. welcome to my video <laughs> peace peace out exactly. see y'all next time <laughs> no yeah but when it comes to like the actual like production of it and everything like it doesn't have to be like super crazy like cinematic or super crazy like better than the last one um as long as your personality shows through what you want to say what you want to project shows through then yeah upload it if you feel like what you want to say and how you want your audience to feel when you're watching your video won't show through then don't put it up mm. but you know if the message is there yeah just do it i feel i feel like we and we keep bringing this up on ooh, the, this house about right, to fall just, down <laughs> real quick <laughs> yeah yeah just is it, the camera's on me okay that breeze though Come here. it feels good though right all right leave it open bro just take down the the curtain <laughs> that was like one of one of our our, our favorite like youtuber creators he's not, he's not technically like a youtube creator have you ever heard of gary vaynerchuk mm -mm. okay so gary vaynerchuk is this he's a ceo of his own company called vayner media mm. he started off way back in the day when like the before the internet and he was like he basically created winelibrarytv.com mm -hmm. where people can go find out more stuff about wine, order wine from his dad's wine store and everything. Mm -hmm. But uh, he, he his, one of the things that, that he preaches is is, um, is quantity over quality. And when a lot of people hear that, they're like, whoa, whoa, whoa what do you mean? I'd rather yeah, have, I'd rather have one really good this than a million of them. But he says, when, it, when they ask him, like, why does he think that qu quantity is better? It's because quality, he says, is subjective yeah exactly exactly like and that's something that's been really hard for me to accept that's why i feel personally that i haven't been consistent because i upload like once every two weeks because i want the video that i post to be super super good and yeah. i want it to be better than the last one but it's like i'm not gonna get anywhere with that because my subscribers are expecting a video like if in youtube time one week is a long time in in like real time like one week is one week but yeah. in youtube time like you watch a video on wednesday you want to watch another person's that same person's video again on friday you yeah. know what i mean yeah um so that's something like i'm still like trying to learn and i've been trying to create a schedule um for like tuesday thursdays and saturdays mm -hmm. i feel like that's what work, work, works best for me 
but yeah like i definitely want to start uploading three times a week because um even if like i can't spend as much time editing to perfection the video like i definitely want to be able to upload more consistently because i feel like that, that's what's most important you know like like i said my the video like the second most viral video was filmed on my iphone yeah like and it, did, did, did you plan that video honestly i was just doing it for fun it was like a fun challenge i just went yeah. to sephora and did my makeup there dang and like my friend that's recorded tight. me yeah and i was just like um she was like you should just record it it'd be funny to watch i'm like okay cool and so i did it and that went viral 